All right, let's take a look at the environment execution. So the life cycle of Lambda has three stages. We have uh, initialize, invoke, and shutdown. So we have uh, those three phases here. Let's just walk through them and see what's going on. So for the initialization phase, we're starting all extensions, bootstrapping the runtime, running the function static code, uh, run any before check runtime hooks for only snap start only. Uh, this, this, this stage is gonna end when the runtime and all extensions signal that they are ready by sending the next API request. The phase is limited to 10 seconds. If it can't finish it in 10 seconds, it's going to retry uh, from scratch. We have the invoke phase. This is when you are actually invoking your function, ready to accept invoke API calls to run the Lambda. The invoke phase is limited to function timeout. So uh, when that runs out, uh, it's done. Ends the runtime and all extension signals that they are ready by sending the next API request. We have the shutdown phase. So send a shutdown event to each registered external extension. Shutdown phase is capped at two seconds. If the runtime or any extension does not respond, Lambda terminates it via the signal using a, a sig kill there. Why would we want to know about this? Well, if we are trying to write uh, Lambda extensions or if we are creating custom runtimes, then you need to understand all this stuff. Um, the execu execution environment contains two API endpoints. We have the runtime API. This is used to run or build custom runtimes. And then you have the extensions API. This is used to run or build extensions which integrate to tools or monitoring observability security group, uh, security or governance tools. And actually technically there are three. Um, when I first made this, there was only two and now there's three. And I guess I forgot to uh, update this text to say um, three. So I'll just cross this out. There's actually, come on pen, there we go. There's actually three, there we go. Uh, and I can't draw <laughs> easily here. My computer's uh, really running slow here today. So we got terrible scribbles. Um, but yeah, those are our three APIs. Um, and so this is the way they look like. So for the extensions and telemetry API, those are when you are creating your own Lambda extensions, which is specifically for uh, creating um, extensions to monitor uh, Lambdas and the runtime API is something you'd work with if you were making your own custom build runtimes. So there you go.